Last Thursday, the fire department in Fremont, California responded to a fire at Tesla's factory. According to a tweet put out by the department, a cardboard baler overheated and caught fire. While the fire was extinguished and contained to the machine, no injuries were reported in the incident. The baler was obviously damaged, as was the tent that it was located in. According to a report from Business Insider, the fire did not disrupt vehicle production as the tent, which holds multiple products waiting to be recycled, was not close to the newer tent that the company uses to assemble the Model 3. You heard that correctly. In a tweet last Monday, Elon Musk said that the company needed another assembly line in order to hit 5,000 Model 3s per week. He said a new building was impossible, so the company spent two weeks erecting a giant tent. The new line was up and running in three weeks. Now, don't jump to conclusions. The company didn't just go out and rent a circus tent. In a photo posted by Musk, you can clearly see the rigid structure in the background as the first Model 3 comes off the line. However, this was the second fire at Tesla in less than a week. A small fire shut down the body production line for a few hours on June 17th. According to the company, an air filter in a welding area was smoldering and took a couple of seconds to put out. According to CNBC, it did trigger Musk to send an email to employees to, quote, be on alert for anything that's not in Tesla's best interests. Yeah, a little paranoid. According to a company representative, Tesla is currently investigating the cause of the fire in the baler. I'm David Manti. This is IEN Now.